Uh, dear ladies and gentlemen, uh, again with you is Francis. So in today's video, we want to learn how we can spread the worksheet windows into different panels. So in the previous two videos, we looked at how we can uh, add the view the different sheets in the new window. We also looked at how we can uh, synchronize uh, different windows and compare different uh, worksheets which are open in different windows or in the same uh, worksheet or in the same window. So today we want to see how we can split the worksheet. Like you have one worksheet, as you can see, I have my worksheet which is open in this workbook. Now, if I want to split it, splitting is like dividing it into two parts uh, so that I can scroll the other part and then I can do whatever thing I want to do on the other part at the same time I do the other thing I want in the other part like you have uh, this pen here which is one complete pen now when you want to split it it means you want to, to uh, divide it into two or you split it into two so you have two parts of the pen so likewise when you are dealing with uh, worksheets in Excel we can split the worksheets windows into different panels. So to do that, we are going to select the view tab in the ribbon. So after selecting the view tab in the ribbon, go and, and look for a group called Windows. After getting it, then you have to select Split Windows. Now, when you select split windows, as you can see on my worksheets, I now have two windows. As you can see down here, I have this first window, which is open. So as you can see, you can scroll, you can scroll uh, right to left. Then you have this one, which is open down, that you can scroll up and down. Even you can see, I have this one up, which I can scroll up and down. Then I have this one here in the other side. So now, uh, how many windows do I have? As now you can see, I have different worksheets. I mean, the, the same worksheet, but has been split into different panels. So I have this panel, I have this panel, I have this panel. I have uh, this panel. So we have around four panels which have been uh, created out of the worksheet. So what we can also do is that uh, we can hide, like we can hide uh, this. After hiding, when you try to open again, there's option for any hide. Because right now, the other sheet is hidden. So to unhide, select unhide. Then you get the, the name of the worksheet, which you want to unhide uh, in this dialog box window. Then you tap OK. And you click on OK. Then it will be uh, now visible for you. We can also go ahead and the freeze some panels. So like if I select this one, which is active, I can click here and say, okay, I freeze the panel to freeze the puzzle. Uh, this will keep the rows and column visible while the rest of the worksheet scroll uh, based on the, the current selection. So when I select that one, now you can see uh, this one, it cannot be, it is just inactive, it cannot, you cannot scroll it. But the other one, like this one, so you can see all this has now become inactive. You cannot, I mean, you can only scroll this, but you can not scroll the other one on top. So to uh, remove the changes, go back to freeze the panel, and then select any freeze. This will unlock all the rows and columns to scroll through the entire worksheet. When you press that, 
then you are now free to scroll uh, through the entire worksheet you can also freeze the top rows on the top of the top rows this will freeze like the rows on top like you see you cannot scroll the top row as you can see I'm scrolling but it's that low which cannot scroll you see so which is row 12 it is it is not scrolling row 12 is not is not scrolling so you can also go ahead and keep the top rows visible so as you can see you keep the top row visible meaning you can easily now see like if I reach here select the row 17 and say uh, this meaning you can scroll up to whatever row you want but the other one which is on top will, be, will remain visible uh, but cannot be scrolled you can also uh, freeze the first column the first column of the worksheet when i select that so you can now see like the first column, which is uh, uh, this column D, as you can see, you can scroll through the entire the other worksheet, the other panel of the worksheet, but the first column is uh, frozen. It has been frozen. Mm -hmm. You cannot scroll on it, but this one is frozen. The or this one, which is this row, is the uh, row one, which is column one. This one is uh, frozen. But this one, this one is free. Meaning this one, you can scroll on it. But this one is it's frozen. So to reset all the changes, you can freeze all the panel. When you freeze all the panel, then now you can scroll all the panels in the, all the panels and all the worksheet together. So Ladies and gentlemen, uh, you're most welcome again. At the same time, I uh, want to encourage you to use Tebitox. You can check to, on our uh, YouTube channel, Tebitox. This is our channel. Go to your YouTube and open Tebitox. Then subscribe so that you can get all the videos when never we upload, you will be notified and then you can use this channel to get whatever thing you want in technology, education, and business. Thank you, guys. Let's catch up in the next video.